is the champion, the man who's held this title for many months, the man known as Primetime. And this is certainly gonna be his most unique challenge yet. He captured the title at Cyber K2 by defeating then champion Sanjay Dutt and he has held it ever since. One of the most fightingest champions here in NWA Cyberspace history. Prime time, Elix Skipper making his return to the ring. And he has two very worthy adversaries to face. And it was the Grim Reefer given this opportunity by virtue of a recent decisive and somewhat violent victory over another Cruiser X competitor, Arcadia. This new vicious Grim Reefer now has his title shot. Which, which I like. It's about time. And to suck up to these fans to win matches. Beat people down with steel chairs. That's how you do it. Uh, the Reefer's always been on that bubble of contendership for this Cruiser X title will today finally be his day. You know, I've said a lot of things about Reefer, and it's been almost two years since he's been chasing that Cruiser X championship. But I tell you what, he finally has discovered the new attitude that could possibly take him there, Strauss. There you see Xavier beating both men down, whips Reefer, Reefer off. That, what, what? Head scissor takes down Elex Skipper. Reefer up ah. and gets club right back down. In a match like this, you got to have eyes in the back of your head. There are two other guys that want that championship just as much as you do. Guys, I hate to take away from the match as Primetime hits an awesome head scissors. But, but the cameras don't know if they caught it, but the smoke is at ringside. He's taking a front row seat and oh. he's watching the action. But why? Hope he just watched that big kick by Xavier right in the face of Reefer. Smoke's on his phone, apparently uh, making some business propositions to somebody out there. Oh, listen to that. We heard it, Reefer felt it. And now there seems to be some sort of an agreement between Skipper and Xavier here. What is this about? Oh, uh, looks like they're gonna work together for now as Xavier tees off. But you know it can't last long. Only one man can win. Only one man can call himself the Cruiser X champ. Exactly. So if I'm Xavier, I wouldn't trust the champion, not by a long shot. Well, let's not forget how Xavier earned this title shot with a victory over the former number one contender, Quiet Storm. So he deserves this opportunity as well. By luck. Xavier applying oh. the headlock on Skipper. Skipper takes him down with a drop toe hold and goes to the front face lock. Elix Skipper has been working hard on his body. He's been working out as much as possible, trying to get back into in-ring shape. We missed him here in NWA Cyberspace, but he appears Ooh. to be back and in great shape. Listen to those chops by Reefer right on the chest of Xavier. Oh. And now. Vicious chops. And I hear the reefer has been preparing for this match by skydiving. At least he told what? me earlier on that he's gotten as high as he possibly can as much as possible. Uh, obviously, you missed the point of that story. Let's just say uh, Strauss was in a cloud on that one. Oh my goodness, nowhere to go for the champion. We got a new champ right here. And only a two count broken up by Reefer. It is first pinfall to a finish, or first submission for that matter. Doesn't matter if Elex Skipper's in the decision or not, that title could change hands. He doesn't even have to be pinned or made to submit. Reefer and ah. Xavier could come to some sort of conclusion and Skipper could be out of a title. That's the chance you take when you defend the title under triple threat rules. Northern Lights throw by And Skipper's Xavier. taking advantage. Oh, so close. He took advantage of Xavier's move right there, and Xavier didn't like it. It's all about finding an opportunity and taking advantage. Prime time landing on the apron. Reefer misses the shot. Oh. And prime time launches. Whoa. Down go both men. Double sunset flip. I've never seen that before. 
Amazing agility right there. You saw Xavier take the sunset flip while Grim Reefer was German suplex clear across the ring. You know, guys, the, the man you want to keep an eye on in this match is Strangler Nick. He's the one that's been really upset ever since the heavyweight championship was taken away from him out of his stable. Strangler Nick and success seem to run in the same sentence around here. You are right. He did manage the former NWA Cyberspace Heavyweight Champion Abyss, but has since been at a loss oh. for gold. Woo! Somebody get some bear, Exeteran, Tylenol, whatever for Xavier. He's got a massive headache right now. He took his eye off the ball for a split second. And in a match like this with competitors like this, that's all it takes. Wow, oh, Xavier evades the clothesline and wipes out prime time on the outside. I don't think Skipper saw that coming at all. And oh. oh, no, watch out for Reefer. You talk about the Reefer getting high. He's climbing the ladder. Walking the plank, oh. standing senton, wipes out both men. That was a beautiful move by Reaper. I tell you what, he's gamed up, ready for this. This could be the big night for him, finally. Reefer, one of the most physically gifted stars here in NWA cyberspace, showing off his skills and really impressing the fans. You can go back to 2004 when Reefer started chasing this championship. It's he been feels a long like run. Yes, you are right, Cradle. Oh, so close. But Xavier kicking out at two. You know, that's something that was going around backstage. Grim Reefer upset. He tried chasing Michael Shane down for the championship. He tried chasing Sanjay Dutt down for the championship. He's finally got an opportunity here tonight against Elex oh. Kipper. But he might not have an app opportunity to walk. take a family down the line. Playing the roast one too many times, and Skipper's going to walk it. Oh! How Two. many times have we seen that? As only Primetime can do, and the all-around best right there to break up any pin attempt that Primetime might have put forth. He's on the shoulders and a oh. gut buster from Xavier. Might have hurt his own knee with that move. And Xavier now standing tall, two fallen opponents, and the cover unsuccessful again because Reefer able to make the save. In his weakened state, he was smart enough to realize he has to break up that three count or the match is over. Primetime back to his feet, whips Xavier into the turnbuckles. Wow. Xavier fights out with a boot. Xavier now second turnbuckle on the inside, catches him with a high cross body. Bridges wow. out. Look at Skipper. Oh, there's that spinning kick. And now it's the champion's playground. And again, Reefer playing the spoiler. And takes the champ into the corner. The Reefer looking to capitalize, but oh. he runs right into the big boot of the champ. Right into it, and Reefer is down. Come on, Nick. Get your guy motivated. Elex Skipper climbing the ropes again, going high risk. But this time, Xavier and Grim Reefer might have caught him. Oh, now what is this? Both, oh, this is dangerous right here. Oh, oh. Bulldog from the top. This could be it. Oh, and Xavier stopping the count. Great presence of mind by Xavier to make his way over there just in the nick of time. My goodness. Tell you what, the only way this match is going to end, somebody's got to take out one of these guys so you can get a clean pinfall. Xavier setting up for something here. Oh, got him up. Wow. That drops him now. Modified slam there and again a two count. What incredible effort. What fortitude shown oh. by these three men. Double oh. that was feet a, to the midsection. That's what we would call a drop kick there, buddy. <laughs> And Reefer wow. set to the outside, and maybe Primetime has succeeded in isolating an opponent. That's the key to this one. Looking perhaps for a suplex into the ring, and no, oh. drops him. Crotch first on the top rope. Hanging him out the dry, and Skipper's going to go on that top rope. Perhaps a guillotine leg drop. We've seen it before. Oh, there it is. With a little axe kick added in for good measure. Prime time laying it all on the line here tonight. And prime time making the cover. Oh. 
And a kick out. Reefer was trying to sneak in the back door. He was trying to get in there. And even Strangler Nick more animated than we've ever seen him. But look at this play of the day. Oh, the pe oh no, he held on to it. He countered into the ankle lock. The submission, the stretch muffler. And uh, Reefer making the save again. But better. Xavier won't let go. Oh, he'll let go now. That was a straight shot right into the chest, exposed chest of Xavier. I've never seen anyone counter the play of the day like that. Xavier certainly doing his homework. Ducks the clothesline, does Reefer. Up in the air. Oh, just drops him down. Fine buster. Oh, oh what? Look at this unique submission right here. Skipper better get in there. Oh. Final tap. It was like a big old bullseye for prime time. We like to call that chiropractic. Primetime would like to call this a victory. He's still got to find a way to take down one of these two determined challengers. Xavier sliding through the legs. Up Pop goes handle. Prime Time. Oh! Right on his head. That's it. He broke his neck. Oh, and watch out for Reefer from the top. Reefer's going to pin Primetime. Wait a minute. He got him. Reefer's the champion. Reefer walked in the back door and stole the NYW Reefer's NWA cyberspace, excuse me, a little excited for later on. NWA Cyberspace Cruiser X Championship. Reefer's the brand new champ. He's done it, finally. Reefer has won the Cruiser X Championship. Years upon years upon years of disappointment. Finally, the gold. <laughs> and a decidedly mixed reaction for the new Cruiser X champion.